Hi there and welcome to another Blog Handy tutorial on how to add an SEO optimized and beautiful looking blog to your existing website. My name is Uwe, I'm the founder of Blog Handy and today we're looking at adding a blog to your UMSO website. UMSO is a great website builder with a lot of AI functionality. So with UMSO, it's the first time you sign up, you just pop in a few details and it creates a site with content out of nowhere. It's amazing, it's really fast, and I've got my site here, but it doesn't have a blog yet. So let's click on Edit Site. Okay, so as a first step, let's click here on the drop down menu, and we don't have any additional pages, we just created the home page. So let's click on Create Page. Under Title, let's say Blog, the past blog, and Save Page. Perfect. Okay. Here we see your new page. So let's click on it and let's remove the subtitle and your new page we're gonna change into blog. And then what we want to do next, let's go one back. So here on the left hand side, you see the hierarchy of your different sections. So we just click on add section and right at the bottom, we click on custom code. Perfect. So let's click now on custom code. And here we have the code section. We can also give it a title here if you want. And here in the code section, we want to put our block handy code snippet. Let's go to block handy and under code snippet, step one, let's copy it and then go back and paste it here. Let's go back once more to block handy. And under the step two code, let's click on copy. And let's go back to the UMSO app and just paste the code here. And that's it. We can click on the back button. In the preview, we won't see our blog, but we can see here on the left hand side that there's a custom code. And at the top, we have the headline. Let's do one more thing. Let's actually switch back to our homepage and Let's go to our header part. Yeah, this one. And let's add our blog in the header menu so our website visitors can find it. Let's have a look here. So we want to add an item. We call it blog and the URL will be the blog. And that's it. Let's click on publish. And here we can now view our page. Okay, perfect. This is our published page. This is a home page. We haven't changed anything here except the blog in the header menu. And let's click on it. And now we're on the blog page and perfect. It loads our blog. Okay, and now there's one more step we have to do. We have to copy the URL of our blog from the address bar. Go back to blog handy and click on settings. And under blog URL, we just paste in the URL to our blog and we click on save all changes. Perfect. So this is our blog. Let's say we want to change the design. The beautiful thing with blog handy is that number one, it takes over your existing websites, design, colors, font choices, and so on. And it applies it to your blog. So you normally don't have to change anything to get started blogging. Number two is we have a number of pre-designed templates that you can find in your settings under layout and design. By default, we just have the modern grid, but you can change those. Let's say you want a more visual design where you use your featured images. I just clicked on the switcher here and it switched over and now we use this design. Let's just refresh. And you can see here, it already got applied. And the beautiful thing is, if you want to change anything from that existing design, you can just go in Block Handy and you can go to the bottom of your settings page and under custom CSS, you can change it to whatever code and design you want by using CSS code. If you're not comfortable with CSS code, you can always reach out to my team and me and we are happy to help you to fully customize your blog free of charge. And let's go back here to your blog once more. 
and let's click on a blog post it loads you have your author information here you've got your blog post in my opinion there are no changes needed but if you want to adjust anything just always use the custom code option or reach out to our support thanks a lot for watching this tutorial today i hope it was helpful happy blogging and bye bye